Entering the 2015 Cowboy football season, OSU will have two new experienced minds on staff. Darrell Wyatt will take on the role as an offensive analyst, and Bill Clay will be the defensive analyst. It'll be the first season ever for OSU to have analysts join the team. It's the first time through for Coach Wyatt and I both at this position and for, for Oklahoma State. I really uh, am another set of eyes for our defensive staff on our opponents. I'm pretty much just trying to analyze as much as I can what our opponents are doing offensively. It's the ability to, number one, self-evaluate yourself and what you're doing and obviously get some advanced scouting and uh, just kind of uh, focus on your opponents and down the road. During a, a practice, you know, I'll have notes, bring the notes in, share the notes with the coaches. Uh, they will typically ask me questions, is there anything that any tendencies you see, anything you see that could help us and you know we kind of interact that way in terms of practice and obviously um, games and preparing for opponents they'll uh, give me certain responsibilities for an upcoming opponent. Of the 10 schools in the Big 12, only OSU and TCU have offensive and defensive analysts. Texas is in the process of hiring one analyst and Baylor's assistant director of football operations also serves as an offensive analyst. And while the position is rare in the Big 12, it's rampant in the SEC. To put things in perspective, Alabama has eight analysts on staff. Something that's somewhat unique to the Big 12, but something that will spread rapidly, I think. It started in the southeastern part of the country, just adding uh, more manpower, more eyes on the team, more eyes on the opponent. I certainly think it could give you an advantage on game day. Well, I think Saban is a big instigator in all of this. And of course, if Alabama's got eight, you know, Auburn's gonna have eight too. This is something that the Power Five conferences are really, all of them are doing. For Darrell Wyatt and Bill Clay, OSU football games start long before fans pile into Boom Pickens Stadium. It starts weeks before to give the Cowboys the best advantage on game day. Game week, it's, it's, it's so busy for the staff, it's hard to get out in front of it. So you have the ability to have guys get out in front of your schedule, out in front of upcoming opponents. The ability, again, to have more eyes on your team, on your opponent, um, really adds to game planning, really helps you, you know, prepare in terms of getting ready for your opponent and their tendencies.